What's up, guys? Welcome back. Welcome back to this more. Let's play a bit. Let's start with the last episode. We get to the dark really. We get to the dark first stuff, and now we're gonna go back into a place where we're born with a support board into the ground. Now we're gonna be uh, looking at this garden, and punching him in the face. Oh man, I really want to punch him in the face. But anyway, welcome back to this more. The fable of lost chapters, and uh, nice you might not have understood uh, the f the past five second Michael, but he just said uh, we just got done with Darkwood Lake, of the Darkwood stuffs. Why can't we? I always wonder why we can't go inside this circle. It's a plot thing. Uh, you could try sleeping on the bed, but I wouldn't. I would. I don't like, really recommend it. Anyway, you're probably building up with some sort of weird Hello tension. So we're going to go ahead and, and head on happened? to inside the Oakville. Prepare for cutscene galore. Not really. Just one. Well, maybe just three. <laughs> Ten. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to shut up now. Am I muted? I don't think so. Darn you, advanced! Hope you guys didn't have to hear that. It just boomed. It scared him. It scared of me. It did. That guy was like unbelievable. And I'm not doing this, by the way. I'm just. I'm just. Why do they look so different now? Oh, who's this? What do you want? Hello. I remember you. We thought you died in that awful bandit raid all those years ago. So where have you been all this time? You do remember me, don't you? I was looking for Rosie, my teddy bear. Oh, I remember days. you. <laughs> I remember. Cost of that day, Holy cow. This... My parents moved to Bowerstone, but I never really liked it there. Yeah. Uh, it's all city. Are you all right? I think I lost you there for a second. Anyway, I have to go now. But it was great to see you again. Bye. Hey, it's a girl that's not actually a jerk to us in this game. Hurrah. Oh, yeah. My microphone lined up. All right, it is. All right. Welcome to Oakvale, guys. One of my favorite areas of the game. Uh, nothing really here to do here first, but I've been debating with myself. Yes, that's possible. And I've been wondering if I'm supposed to, if I should do this. Oh, hey, there's amazing. Oh, whatever. Um, we're, uh, I'm gonna, fine, I'll talk to him. What do you want? Ah, there you are. Uh, I thought maybe you were getting too famous to be seen around here. I can't tell if Maze is being jealous or sarcastic or I'm just afraid I've heard nothing mocking. More of your sister. And there's little else I can do. There is hope yet, though. A blind seeress lives among Twinblade's bandit clan. Oh, sweet. Sounds she awesome. may be able to tell you about your sister. Oh. Nice shot of the boat there. The CRS stands next to the bandit king himself. And it's no coincidence the bandits have been doing so well lately. Have you heard of Twinblade? He was a hero once. Yes, giant of a man. He had little patience for the guild, though. He left and brought together a dozen bandit factions. Oh, man. I always suspected he was behind the attack on your home. This could be your chance for revenge. The camp can't be far from here. The village is often under attack. I've left a quest card at the guild. This part can often leave people in the dirt. Like, you can dig your own grave by doing this. This is stupid what they did. You have to go all the way back Check to the guild to get this quest. Oh, I thought it was a bandit. To get this quest. Now, there is several things we can do here before we leave. And I'm going to be keep yelling at you. Anyway, there's a store over here where you can do stuff. And there is something... Uh, fine, I'm going to do it this way. I'm not going to do it the way that he wanted me to do it. However... Actually, yeah, I'll do it the way he's supposed to do it. Just for fan stuff. Okay, this is two things over here that you could want to get. That is a cave, which will be important later on. This is a chest. No, it's a, it's a, it's a thing. It's a whatever. I'm not very good at being sarcastic today. Anyway, we got assassin boots, which is good for selling. I personally don't use it because it's not really that good towards uh. Almost left. Where are your uh, jeez. Okay, your uh, uh, alignment. So let's go ahead and talk to this girl, lady, thing. I often stand out here and look out to sea. My dear husband was lost to the waters years ago. He went on a fishing expedition and never came back. 
I haven't given up hope of seeing him again one day. Aw. That's so sad. Anyway. Uh, her husband... I'm, I'm going to be spoiling this immensely for you, but her husband is indeed dead, and you can get his, you can get to him. And this is going to be needed to be done for the 100% run. Uh, am I going up here? I am. If you can look on the map, you'll see that there's a little uh, little beach there with a little water surrounding it. And the bottom right corner of the map. We're going to be going over there. Hey, uh, hero, uh, can you... Uh uh, yeah, I'll oh, tell you, but I uh, can. Okay. I, I'll be right back, guys. I gotta go take care of something real quick, eh? Bye. BRP. Alright. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. I don't know why you had to be sorry about that, because I was only gone for two seconds for you, but it was like ten minutes for me. Anyway, down here. Oh, what was that? Um, I'm going away from that. Uh, what did that guy want up there? He wanted hey, something. Uh, hero, uh, can you uh, help me out? <laughs> oh, a hero! I could really use your help, sir. Okay. <laughs> he talks so slow. I run a harmless little chicken contest down on the beach, but I'm having a bit of ghost trouble. Some deceased chicken fancier, no doubt. The thing is, he's scaring all my punters away. You couldn't, you know, work some of your hero magic and get rid of him, could you? I guess I could. Alright, well, let's pick him. Let's go! Uh, charge! Oh, I'm not afraid! Tender. What the? I can't even... Okay, what do, what do you say? Try to get your combat multiplier even higher. Ah, <laughs> at long last, a kind soul who doesn't flee at the sight of me. I have cased this forsaken beach for so many years. Could it be that you be sent by the gods to lift me from my fierce torment? Possibly. I don't know. Help the ghost. <laughs> <laughs> what you do? Yeah, I gotta. My spirit dwells at the bottom of the sea. Ah, and my poor wife is left to destitute and to grieve. Ah, she thinks I was but a simple fisherman and still be somewhere lost at sea. It may shock you to learn, dear friend, that I had a small side business in piracy. Ah, I did my simply plundered treasure next to the jetty on the western beach. If you want to use a spade to dig it up and give it my work, I will reward you with plentiful riches, you old sea god. If you be in need of a spade, they be sold in town. Alright, sounds cool. Anyway, there's another thing you can do inside his house. There's a chest. Which I think you can only get now. So I would pick it up if I were you. This oak crossbow. Holy cow. What do we have now? No, not map. Good lord. Uh, Ebony longbow? Are you crying? Man. Holy cow, dude. Uh, this is chicken. Where are you? Okay. Uh, nothing. Never mind. Uh, it's not important. Anyway, uh, pfft, what you're supposed to go do is supposed to go get the jetty. You got rid of that ghost yet? The jetty is a, a, it's so hard to find if you're doing it by yourself. I did this first time, my first time I was doing it blind. I eventually had to Google it because you get a silver key from all this. Yes, you have to do it for 100%, silver key is what you need to get 100%. Now the jetty is this right here. You're supposed to go to the side of this thing right here and dig. Five hundred gold. That is the treasure. That may not seem like a lot to you, but to these people, it is. I suppose. Let's go ahead and give it to the lady. Bye. Hey, lady. <gasps> oh my goodness! This bling is from my husband. You say he saved it up by taking Taurus out on his boat. <laughs> yes, I, I 
do remember seeing him take people on board. But they looked like bandits from a distance. Isn't that silly? I knew he really cared for me. He was such a good, honest man. Yeah, I know. You talk too much. Did she just walk? Okay, I thought she ran. Uh, wait, 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 wait. All right. Uh, the next thing you're supposed to do is. I really hate to do it this way. I wanted to go get the treasure. I know where it is. You can get it before you do all this. I wanted to go get the treasure and then just go to do the quest. We might have to do that next time because it's already five minutes. I guess we can do some of it. Oink. Oink. You got rid of that ghost. I will punch you in the face. Leave me alone. What is that outside my window? Is it free little birds? No, I don't think so. Alright, ghost. Man, your pet chicken's really annoying. Get out of here. Ugh. Yeah, I know. Avast is a good uh, software there, dude. Enjoy your cat. But before I leave, I shall keep my end of the bargain. Ah! The rest of the swag is buried. Under the axe of a statue in the local graveyard. Under the axe of a statue. Be there. You're a welcome to me. Now, thank ye and goodbye. All right, that's one of the two ghosts we gotta help in this game. Ghosts, yeah. And it is nighttime. I guess we could go uh, sell the stuff off after you got we go rid get of that the treasure. Uh, what you get for the treasure? really iffy. Oh, ooh, 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 I just got reminded of something. This is another one of those guys who can uh, help you fight if you, if you would need it. If you're new to the game, I would suggest you get one of them. But you have to be careful. If you hit them, you could kill them, you know. That's typical, you know. You hit somebody with a sword, they die. That's why. Ha ha. How about you? Whatever. Um. Uh, right here is where it's buried. I love the animation in, in Lost Chapters. In Fable, there's like a huge cuts in Silver Key and Obsidian Great Axe. Don't get your hopes up. This is not you a good, familiar status. a good thing. The Obsidian Great Axe is just as powerful as well as Pick Hammer. However, it does not have two piercing, and it is two-handed, which means it is a lot slower. So the good part about all this is. You can sell it. Which is what we will do in the... No, I'm not going to end off the episode yet. We have one more thing we have to do before I end it off. Do you remember in uh, the Guild Forest, that guy who had a weird voice? Huh? Myra? And she lived in Oakvale or something like that. Well, Myra is actually right over here. Yeah, that's Myra right there. Do you think I'm pretty? I met this man at a party in the Guild Woods who says I am. I think... I think you might be in love with me. You haven't spoken to him, have you? Okay. <laughs> yeah, give him oh, the letter. Is this... is this from you? And you can say, uh, is, you, is, it, is it from you? Is he way to get a wife? And lie to Myra and say the letter's from you? No. I don't believe it. He really does love me. He says my eyes are like two glowing suns. Could have been the I mushrooms. Let him know I feel the same. You know what they say. Could you take this to him? What would Proton John say? I to tell Fiona about this. Fiona? Apply from Myra. Hope you're happy. Ooh, what's the sign say? Show me a sign. Okay. Ah, no, stop it. Okay. All right. Thank you guys for watching. Chest. Thank you guys for watching Chest. Uh, no. <laughs> That's a weird angle. <laughs> all right, what we got? Resurrection file. Before we end up the episode, I'm going to be selling all my stuff so we can see my statistics up to the point of the game. The game. Okay, whatever. We actually haven't gotten any more experience. While we're in the guild, I might as well upgrade a 
couple stuff. So this is the, the tavern. You will be so shocked to know. Well, I was shocked. This guy right Hey, thanks for the drink. Yum, yum. Okay, anyway. This guy does not own this tavern. The guy who owns this tavern is this guy over here. <laughs> this guy. Ugh, I don't get it at all. I think it's like 50 gold to sleep here. 100 gold. Holy cow. I guess 100 gold's worth more than waiting. Alright. This is the very good place to grind for money because you can actually uh, steal things if your guile is good enough. Like there's plate boots right there. There's, there's chain boots right there. There's all kinds of stuff. Stuffs. There's uh, little mitts, there's gloves here, there's a helmet, chainmail helmet, and then there's more hmm. chainmail boots. Anyway, what you got? Master. Talking to you. Yeah. We think we so can do stop. Yeah. Offer for okay. You, sir. Items, others. Uh, yeah, I'll sell that. And weapons. One obsidian great axe. I'll sell that. Uh, I want to keep the ebony longbow. Sell the crossbow, sell the... What did I just sell? Okay. Sell that. Clothing. Hands. Villager gloves. Sell those. Shoe, why did I do that? Man, they're so stupid. I so stupid! Okay, uh, villager boots. Sell those. I have no gloves on now, do I? Ay, ay, ay. Why am I so stupid? It's okay, though, because we can... Uh, Put on a different suit. Village outfit. Uh, let's see here. Hang on a second. Uh, hands. There we go. That's good enough. All right, our armor is really stupid. <laughs> anyway, uh, now that we've done that, I think it's a good time to end off the episode. So, next time on Fable of the Lost Chapters, we're going to be getting this stupid quest from the guild. Luckily, we can just teleport there. No, don't follow. No. No, no, no. No. <laughs> Wait. Go away. Talk to the hand. Anyway, we can just teleport so I don't do this to the guild, and I will see you there at the guild next time. And hopefully this video will go up tomorrow or in a row of a day and not months from now. Alright. Reaper's the one over there.